It has been 28 minutes since the last mission commenced. Please provide a stabs report. We haven't found the target or any survivors. Are you sure the target is here? My name is Will. The SCP Foundation hired me to carry out various missions when needed. Essentially, I'm a mercenary. Today's mission is to find a creature that escaped from the Foundation's facility. Interesting. Have you at least found traces of the target's presence? You mean traces of corrosion? Yep, we've definitely found those. Corrosion marks are on the walls, chairs, floors, just about everywhere. Understood. At least we have that much. All of you, be on your guard as the target can appear without warning. Today's target is exceptionally dangerous, isn't it? The report said that it has killed several people since its discovery. Shouldn't we destroy- The Foundation's doctrines discourage the destruction of anomalies. Your only objectives are as follows. Confirm the target is in the facility, and if the target is found, do not make contact with it. You are simply to buy time until my team is ready to move out. So, for this mission, we don't have to capture the target ourselves. We are just there to delay it, right? That is correct. We have specific procedures for reconfining the target. Furthermore, our target, SCP-106, has the ability to corrode anything it touches. Contact with it is naturally ill-advised. Stop! Don't go any further! What is that? It looks like we found our target. Um, it's coming closer. What should we do? I'll get its attention. Katie, you stay back and protect the team from any incidental hazards. Right, okay. At least it's pretty slow. So keeping our distance shouldn't be too hard. Whoa! 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 What happened? It's got me! Oh! What on earth? What is this? Some kind of new corrosion? Damn it! We lost signals from the other members! Did it teleport somewhere else? If only it were that simple. The creature's secondary ability is to create a pocket dimension that only it can enter. It accesses this dimension through solid matter, and it leaves its corrosion traces when entering or exiting that space. So the really big patches of corrosion are... Those are the entry and exit points it goes through when hunting. Yes! Damn. Katie, run. Stay away from the walls and get out of here. And keep an eye on the floor. SCP-106 could show up anywhere. What about you? We should both get out of here. I'll stay here and keep it busy. If you stay here, it'll get both of us. But... but... Just go! You'll only slow me down here. Fine. Just please be careful. Hey, just out of curiosity. Is there any way to save the people that it takes? No. Anyone taken by SCP-106 is considered dead, without exception. Why is it taking people? Is it just looking to eat us, or take us somewhere before killing us? Not quite. Huh? SCP-106 is no normal predator. It spends its time toying with the people it has captured, and then it releases them. It releases them? Didn't you say that all people it captured were to be considered dead? Well, if you see what becomes of those SCP-106 releases, you would understand why we must declare them dead. If it's releasing them, why is it going to all the trouble of hunting them in the first place? I can't say for sure, but the leading theory is that it wants... Are you okay? Wants what? It wants an audience, someone to see it, but more than that, someone to experience it. I think it wants us to see what it has done and is capable of. Huh? Oh no! N no! Stay back! Stay back! Go away! Um, is this thing sensitive to light? Katie, can you hear me? 
Whatever you and Will have done, you've succeeded in stalling SCP-106. We are ready to reconfine it now. What was that scream? Nothing you need to be concerned about, but I suppose we are bribing SCP-106 just a little. It's gone. Thank you both for your efforts. SCP-106 has been successfully confined. You may return to headquarters and undergo memory processing. Damn it! Ah, that hurt! This wasn't how I was told it would go. There's already an established method for recovering SCP-106 when it escapes. It has demonstrated a preference for humans between 10 and 25 years old. A young man's screams are irresistible for it. Therefore, when it escapes, the surest way to recapture it is break the femur and restrain D-Class personnel, and lure it back with screams. G g get away from me! You, you freak! Stop! Stop! There is no way to recover the D-Class personnel who is used as bait. As soon as SCP-106 returns from its pocket dimension, its containment chamber is sealed immediately. This chamber is made with multiple layers, fluids, and struts that are difficult for SCP-106 to penetrate. However, even with such a strict containment protocol, the Foundation struggles with the fact that these efforts offer no guarantee of containment. They only make it more difficult for the being to escape. There is no surefire way to completely contain SCP-106 as of yet.